What's up guys, Royce here back today for another unboxing video. As you can notice, I've got quite a big box in front of me and I'm actually exhausted after bringing the box to the collection because it weighs a ton. This is actually the new Hollywood Collectibles Group Jeepers Creepers Bust and I'm actually very happy because I don't have any Creeper in my collection. I used to have Hart by Uhem one but I had to sell it quite a while ago and since then, you know, I never had a a creeper in my collection and I was really missing one okay so I got the polyfilm out of the box because it was a hell truly really a nightmare to uh, get it get it out of the box but we managed to do it so here it is it weighs a ton as I said probably around 20 kilos I'm sorry I, I don't know it's how much it weighs in pounds but you guys can do the conversion if you want but uh, I can't wait to see this creeper live you know I was afraid it was going to be a tad small but apparently not it's actually huge I mean at least the box is and I have a very special project with this bus actually I'm still unsure about that project but simply when I saw some uh, customer pics of this bad boy I felt like the paint job could use a few touch up you know and I started painting my own pieces, I mean at least I've done one, I painted a Exorcist bust, which I'm quite proud of, I mean it was my first paint up. You guys will see some pictures here, I hope you guys like the result, make sure to let me know in the comments if you like the end result as well. I told myself, if I don't like the paint job, I'll go repaint it, I'll go ahead and repaint it, but if the paint job ends up being cool, I mean good enough, I'll just keep it as is, but probably change a hair, because uh, I've seen the hair on a few customer picks and I hate it. But Let's first check it out. I'll just put this on the floor, cut it open, and I'll show you guys how it looks in the box. All right, so here it is. It's amazing, truly an amazing sculpt. I gotta be honest, not, not a huge fan of the paint at all. So I'm gonna repaint it myself. I just feel like it's, you know, it lacks some nuances. It's just a, too much of an airbrush uh, job. I cannot wait to repaint it, to be honest. I cannot wait to show you guys what I'm gonna do with it. So the end shots will be the repainted version. I won't bother doing some uh, fancy shots of this version. I mean, it's still a great piece for the for the price. Honestly, it's not that it's not that pricey. I got mine for quite a good deal. It was shimp shipping included. I didn't get no custom fees, and I actually got it super fast. Cause you know, I'm in Europe, and in Europe, it's not gonna be released before either March or June of 2021 so it's like December of 2020 and I'm very happy to be one of those early birds and to be getting one of those uh, creeper busts before uh, you know the European uh, customers but very happy with it I mean the sculpt is great I think it's one of the best likeness I've seen of the creeper played by portrait by Jonathan Brake in the Victor Salva movie. I know this piece was sculpted by Bjorn Elmark at M Studio and you can tell it actually went ahead and sculpted a nail of a likeness to be honest. The likeness is amazing, you can truly see all the facial structure of the creeper, those magnificent, you know, I don't know what you call those, but even the ears are very accurate. I also wanted to mention that, you know, those little darts, uh, those one as well I think, and the teeth are acrylic, you know, very uh, real acrylic, and then you know it gives real uh, some 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 sense of reality and you know overall better looking piece, I guess. I'm not sure about the eyes. No, the eyes are painted. I'll I'm not sure if I'm going to tackle those because the eyes are actually what scares me the most uh, in painting busts. But but I love it to be honest. I'm a very big fan of the piece. Love the base. Actually, I was afraid it was gonna be too big, you know, and too massive. But no, it, it's very nice. It's just, you know, the the wholeness of the piece is actually very cool. It doesn't feel like it has a huge base, you know, and that's just a and you know, it's it's not out focusing the uh, attention on the bus. I mean, I'm not sure if I'm being correct in English, but I, I think you guys got me. It, so it's nice. It got the Jipper Scooper style, and this is actually chrome paint. It's a nice touch, I think. And you know, the base really uh, feels like uh, a part of the truck. I think that's what they the, they went for. Uh, I'm not gonna move it, I'm sorry, but it's just way too much and uh, I don't wanna risk breaking it. You know, I just got it, so I wouldn't want that to happen. But those are actually magnetized, you know, that's sweet. Up, up. If you guys ordered one of those, I'm sure you're gonna be happy with it, because I am, honestly. It's just that I'm, you know, the perfectionist that I am, I just want something that's straight out of the movie. 
the scope is, the paint isn't. Again, it's a mass produced piece, so it, you know it's it's not like you're gonna get a uh, I don't know a Jude Bungard's bust maybe or a custom fan made paint job, you know. But but yeah, for a mass produced piece, it's a nice, it's a very nice bust. Great job from Hollywood Collectibles Group, cause. I don't know how many people have been waiting for a Creeper bust and except our Bayou M with his uh, V1 and V2 bust, no one has ever tackled this piece. I know that Brian Pennygast, the guy that worked on Jeepers Creepers, offered the severed head version, not a severed head, but just the head of that particular version, you know, with the tentacles and the fangs opening up, but it was hell pricey. I mean, probably worth it, but this one is actually quite affordable for such a big bust, such a big resin bust, and uh, yeah, very happy with it. I can't wait to show you guys what I'm gonna do. I'll probably record some stuff, you know, me painting it. I don't know, I'm not sure. I forgot to mention the only downside to me is actually this hair. Uh, it feels so cheap, like a wig from a Halloween store. Hollywood Collectibles Group, you could have done better on this. I mean, it does the work, you know, it does the job, but could have felt maybe a more, uh, a little bit more quality if you, if you see what I mean. If you're a Creeper fan, you guys won't be disappointed. It's amazing. Actually, I think they're on low stock. So they might get sold out very soon. People will start uh, getting it. So you guys, if you want one of those, go grab one now and you won't regret it later on. I have a photo shoot of this particular bust once I repainted it on my Instagram account. So if you want to see it, make sure to follow me at LauriStakesPix. I'll have the link in the description as well. Thank you guys for watching. I love making those collectibles well videos. I love showing great pieces like this one and being honest with it, you know. Because, you know, I had comments from people saying, yeah, you keep saying all the shit on all your pieces. Well, I buy what I like. I mean, I buy what, what gives me the wow factor, right? And I can't, I, I, I'm honest. So when I see some things that are not that amazing, I just can't say it just like this paint job. But, but again, it's because I'm picky, I guess. All right, so that was Loris from Collectibles UL. I know I talk too much. Uh, make sure to let me know in the comments what you guys think about this boss. If you think I, that I am nitpicking by repainting it, it's totally fine with me. Just let me know. Make sure to subscribe if you don't want to miss the future videos. I actually have a grail of mine uh, on the way, which I'll have a, an unboxing video of. So if you don't want to miss it, make sure to subscribe. You guys won't be disappointed, trust me, especially if you like horror. See you very soon for more videos or some collectibles you all sign off. Up. How to get that size? Molly G. When you turn those heaters on, Paul is me. Got to put my heaters on. Jeepers, creepers. Try to get those peepers. Oh, those weepers. How they hypnotize. Yeah. Where'd you get those eyes? La 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 Got to put my cheetahs on. Weepers, creepers, where'd you get those peepers? All oh, those weepers. How they hypnotize. Knock me out. Where'd you get those eyes? Where'd you get them? Won't you put me wide? Don't you try, man. Pay to advertise. Tell them something. Where did you get those eyes?